Welcome back, guys. As you last saw, you know, we pretty much put down that rebellion. And we pretty much, you know, how should I put it? Retained order, you know? So the Marathans pretty much have a good foothold in India, and we pretty much have everything working for us. So now all we're going to do is pretty much wait for the Mysores to attack. And remember how I said that one part was boring? Yeah, I lied. This is going to be the most boring part because pretty much all we do is stir at the Mysores and wait for them to invade the Portuguese city. And that takes a really long time. I mean, like, seriously. So here comes the lag, flag, waving of awesomeness. And you know, the same stuff you guys seen it a million times. So since this part's pretty much boring, I'm going to talk about some of the other stuff I've been planning. I was thinking about doing a France campaign in Empire, or maybe a Swedish one, I don't know which one yet. I was also planning on doing a Chosokabe campaign for Shogun 2 here. I'm in the middle of it right now and I'm almost becoming Shogun, attacking Kyoto as we speak. And I was also planning on doing some Mountain Blade 1 videos, you know. Just show you a campaign and what. Uh. So, you know, I'm working on those. I also have Hearts of Iron 3. I played around with it, you know, but in the end, it was it was just boring as hell. I, I can't get into it. I seriously tried. And it was just boring. There, you know, whatever. I know some people are into that sort of thing, but unless there's animations or like. You know, at least showing me some battle. I can't play the game. It's just too boring. But, you know, whatever. People like different things, and I don't care. So, if you like it, cool, but I don't. I was also thinking on doing a Scottish campaign for Medieval. Or a Venice, or something along those lines, you know. Just to do a Medieval campaign, since I haven't really touched that one real much, you know. And, uh, later on, I was also going to do some, you know, Sid Meier's Pirates. Also, yeah, for those of you who were waiting for my Asamite playthrough on Vampire to Masquerade, I'm working on it, so please be patient. It takes me a while, especially since I haven't really played a Asamite, you know, I don't know their strengths and weaknesses. But yeah, I'm sure most of you don't know what that is, so it's all good. I was going to do some Warcraft, you know, gameplay, but it turns out my recording device really likes to freak out whenever I try to record it, like, it's horrible, it's not even like Rome Total War horrible, man, like, how should I put it, like, when I videotape, if you guys haven't seen my, uh, Fable opening cutscene video, imagine that, but five times worse, that's exactly what happens when I try to record Warcraft. I get all these like dope colors like it's a hippie fest in the 70s and we're all like tripping on LSD or something, it's crazy. And you know, whatever. And you know, I was also going to do some Warhammer Mark of Chaos and maybe some Fable Lost Chapters. But you know, I gotta beat some stuff first, so that's going to be way later on down the road. So yeah. How are you guys? I feel kind of weird talking to my computer screen because I know you guys can't talk to me, but whatever. So let's see what these people in the game are doing. So right now, we got, you know, this army guy here and he's just standing there waiting for orders, ready to die and fight for the glorious nation of the Marathans. Because he knows if he doesn't, I'm going to shoot him. I mean, what? Oh yeah, you didn't hear a damn thing, I swear. So, as you stare to the north, you can pretty much realize that almost, you know, everything in northern India is mine, which is cool. And I really want the rest of India so I can unite it under the Marathan Empire. Yeah. So, you know, it's our turn now. And for some reason the game decided to lag like hell once I hit this part, so I'm sorry. You know, because I don't exactly know why it would do that. 
I think it has something to do with the fact I made so many blenders and I made so many smoothies out of the babies that, you know, the game decided it couldn't take no more and it started puking and that's why the performance dropped horribly. Or maybe it just gave up knowing that soon I would conquer the world, you know, but that's cool. I don't care what it thinks. That's why we invented ham sandwiches, you know. And what else am I gonna talk about to pass the time? Yeah, sorry, I just kinda got up. I'm recording this at like 11 a.m. and I'm like out of it. It's like I'm talking to the ground or something. Except the ground is all moving and it's like zombies are gonna pop out and like devour my flesh. Not really, but you get the idea. No, I'm joking actually, zombie walruses are everywhere. I told you man, when the radiation hits they're gonna mutate, turn into vampires, proceed to feed on our flesh, and then zombies will be created from the humans which are devoured. And those humans will then proceed to feed on other people causing the disease to spread and zombies will rule the world as their vampire walrus masters sit behind the darkness of the veil and begin to control us like puppets. And but there will be very few who die as their souls are devoured by demons and they make pact with the undead in order to gain unholy powers to destroy the vampire walruses and their masters. Sort of like Castlevania or some dope shit, you know, but whatever. P.S. I never really played Castlevania. Well, I played a few, but like, I never really got into the story. Uh, what else? What else? Something about ham. That's all I can remember. Oh well. Do to do. So yeah, as you can see here, we're pretty much just recruiting big ass armies. You know why we're recruiting big ass armies? Because we still have conquests to go to. And if you don't, you know, beat this conquest, there's a serious problem. I don't care who you are. And as you can see, you can see all the great glorious nations, flags, you know, I'm not gonna lie, I have never seen a nation go through a revolution if it's an AI. I have never seen an AI nation have a revolution. Have you guys seen that? Because I haven't. I'm just saying it now. Man, I'm tired. Oh, and uh... Thanks for the 53 subscribers, guys. It's really nice. But if you don't get me more, I'm gonna have to blend your baby, so I'm, j I'm joking. Thank you, really. In fact, while you're all doing this, I wanna offer you all smoothies. Yeah. There's some chunky bits in it, you know, from the brain and the skull and whatnot. But if you want it, you can drink it. Here you go. You know. Go ahead and drink it. No, don't disappoint me. I put all my care and my love and my dedication into it. And you're just going to turn it down because of a few baby brains. You are weird, you freaks. I'm just saying. And yeah. I hope you have a great day. And as you can see here, I think that my sword army is about to finally take that Portuguese city. I hope they are anyway. It would make my day. Aw, oh, damn. Look at them, dude. Like, what are they doing? They're just like, sitting there all like, We are a Mysore army. Ho ho. Eh, this is real boring. So, yeah. One sec. So, yeah. Nothing really to talk about right now. Except that those Mysores are trying to look all badass, you know? And since this part's almost over, I think I'll let you guys off here. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you next time. So red power, my brothers, for soon our time shall come. And I will see you next time. Don't forget to like, subscribe, blah, blah, blah. I hate saying that, because, you know, I hate it when people tell me to do that. So yeah, I will see you guys later.